We have all read or heard of the classic children's novel Thomas the Choo Choo Train. This book teaches us at a young age what self-determination is and how it can be used effectively. The big fast train, Gordon, challenges the smaller and slower train, Thomas, to a race. Thomas knows that there is no way he is faster, but he is still very determined to beat Gordon. Thomas is losing the whole race until he finds a tunnel to go through that Gordon did not see. He comes out of the tunnel in the lead and from there holds Gordon off to win the race. Ultimately, Thomas won the race because he never gave up and he never caved in. His self-determination allowed him to persevere through the doubt of beating the bigger and faster Gordon. Self-determination allowed Thomas the train to be successful and I believe that the same applies to us humans as well. To me, self-determination is what drives each of us as individuals. We all have it in us, and we all use it for different reasons. I was just thinking about the essay I wrote in Mrs. Ramey's on intrinsic and extrinsic motivation. Essentially, these two ideas are two of the same. Intrinsic motivation equals that inner self-determination, and extrinsic motivation is equal to those outside forces pushing you. I believe that the intrinsic motivation in you, or the self-motivation you possess, makes each of us who we are. Self-determination is as simple as not doing your homework or just sitting down and getting it done. When we use our self-determination effectively, we can accomplish or achieve many wonderful things. But when we don't, that is when we fail. Yes, we will always have some form of an outside force pushing us, but to actually become successful or accomplish something that has to come from within. We all know the difference in the feelings of doing something because we were forced to, or achieving something because we were determined to do it for ourselves. I truly believe that without my personal self-determination, I would not be where I am in life today. I would never have been able to have the opportunity to achieve a lifelong dream of mine. I would not be at this point of having the extraordinary opportunity to attend the University of Oregon while having the chance to walk on to their outstanding football team. Yes, there have always been outside motivators helping push me along the way, but ultimately, my self-determination has led me to this opportunity to achieve my dream. Self-determination is a great and powerful force that is inside everyone. The problem is whether or not an individual decides to use it to his or her benefit. Self-determination can pave a road of success to accomplishing dreams. I believe in the power of self-determination. And like Thomas the Train, when we use this power effectively and beneficially, we can achieve many great things. This, I believe.